The Liberian National Police has seized high-grade military arms and ammunition believed to be shipped by an American Liberian named Benjamin Boyd Baker. Police Inspector Patrick Sudu says, in addition to the consignment of arms and ammunition discovered at the port of entry, additional arms and ammunition were found at the home of Benjamin Boy Baker in the township of Brewerville. Uh, during the search and seizure, we, we checked all of the rooms and did not find uh, any contraband. So we decided to check in the attic of the house, the ceiling. And when, we, when our men climbed up in the ceiling, they saw a guy by the name of Ezekiel Tama, who was hiding in the attic. So he was brought down and we decided to check the ceiling using our gadget, lights and things. So we came across five fully automatic weapons snapper weapons, uh, Ramiton, double barrel, and we managed to bring the weapon down with some cash of ammunition. Speaking further, Inspector Sudu said the shipper of the container, Benjamin Boy Baker, passport copy indicates that he is a Liberian and that he has been verified by the Liberian Immigration Service, but at the moment, he cannot tell whether Baker will be extradited to Liberia or tried in the U.S. Well, uh, we we have his passport, copy of his passport. He is a Liberian. He was verified through the immigration, Liberian Immigration Service. He is a Liberian American. So uh, the issue of extradition, I will not speak much to that, but the Ministry of Foreign Affairs is working along with its counterpart, the U.S. Embassy, to see how the whole issue can be mitigated. Either he will be brought here or he will be tried in the U.S. So, I mean, the process is ongoing, I can show you, but from the standpoint of the police, we are not blue with the authority to see whether he will be tried here or extradited to Liberia also. Additionally, Police Chief Superintendent Roland Jimmy disclosed that the weapons and ammunition discovered and seized are all military style weapons, are both single action and fully automatic, and some are self reloaded model. Superintendent Jimmy said there are other ammunition whose rifles have not been found. Yeah, the weapons are not here, like this one. We don't have the weapon for this. Like this one, this one, the weapon for it is not here. Yeah, it is not here. These are terrible, very, very, very terrible rounds. This, this round is a kind of a, a military round. It's had a, a explosive signal on it. With the wave of coup d'etat in the sub-region, the motive for the importation of such high-grade military weapons and dozens of ammunition speaks volume to how volatile the fragile peace in Liberia remains as we approach the holding of elections in the country.